now. All right. So there are ten levels in the game. Um, they're all very short. This is the shortest of all the Vex games to run. Um, I'm just say you're a stick figure guy. You need to get to the end. There's no story. There's a couple of skips. We'll be skipping a lot of the levels. Uh, not this level. I failed that one. That's fine. Oh, thanks, Slicer. So here's a skip coming up. I found uh, saves around three seconds if I do it correctly. Perfect. There's another skip in two, a skip in four, and a minor skip in five. Uh, this game's all execution has no RNG. Um, the entire Vex series has no RNG, it's all execution. The, the timing for that jump I just did to the blue block is very tight. Um, Thankfully, I have a, a nice setup that's really consistent with me. So, I was able to do it quite perfectly. Yeah, like, this game is fairly easy, uh, like, you can beat this game in, like, less than 30 minutes on your first attempt, uh, but, uh, Vex 2 and 3 will take you a lot longer than, alright, well, I'm not gonna get that. So I just skipped the entire level because, um... Who needs I don't like this level. I really don't like it, so I'm just gonna skip it. Uh, there's not really much to to say, I mean. It's very linear, there's a couple skips here and there. Uh, a couple I found, a couple that Ninja Nass and Hollis Nicole found on the speedrun.com website. Some were actually in, uh, found by Wreck and Null. I'll have to give a shout out to them. Uh, this jump skip right here was found by Wreck and Null. Thanks, Wreck and Null. I guess I should talk about uh, the other games as well, because there's not much to talk about this game. Uh, Vex 2, I'll be doing low percent. That is a separate category where you can't use any of the levers. I'll describe that later. And in Vex 3, we're doing 100% where... Uh, yeah, Vex 100%, I don't, I don't like to talk about it. I have kind of a setup here so I can release from this pole right here at a perfect time and not get hit by the bus saw, but just trim it uh, to get the most optimal time. This pattern is always consistent. Yeah. Oh gosh. Alright, that was okay. Vex 200% isn't that bad. It's it's a good, like, sub-25 minutes, um, depending on how good you are. Vex 3 is... oh gosh. Thank you, Lizzie Trap, for your definition of 100% Vex 3. That is very accurate. Act 8 right here is the worst level ever. Um, it's, it's a bit random from what I understand. Oof. 
sure I thought I can make it, but uh. These cycles can be a bit off. I don't know how to manipulate them or how to get the best result. It, I just, it's just a giant crapshoot. This wall right here is very glitchy. Sometimes I'll just fall off the wall um, for no reason whatsoever. It's purely random. But that was a that was a good one of the level. Last level right here. Um, this could be a PB. Uh, I don't know. I'll have to take this really safe. Yep, PB. World record. That was easy. Six oh eight. 0.73, that beats the new record by two seconds. Uh, that was easy. Um, I did many and many attempts to beat my old world record of 612. I recently just got it, and now I just did it again. Well, neither does 100% laser trap uh, for Vex 3, because the achievement time flies, it's still there. See ya. PB. Alright, moving on to Vex 2. Alright, I'm just going to switch over to Vex 2. I have them all bookmarked. Um, Alright, fair enough.